time to go bang out some biceps and back today. So let's get it, mate. Grenada all day, every day represented. So we started off the session with a bit of warm up in the back. You know, just getting the wide grip pull up. The wider the grip, the better. Uh, you know, give your back that full stretch and make sure you go all the way down. And me, I try to go so that my chin goes over the bar. But you don't always have to. That's up to you. That's a pretty good, um, pretty good way to ensure you get a full stretch, though. So give that a go and see how everything feels in the end. If you can't go as high, no problem. At least ensure you go so that your the top of your head at least reaches the bar. Next, I moved on to some um, I don't know cable pulls. I guess you can call this seated rows. And yeah, as you can see, I'm doing some lightweight just to warm up for a bit. You know, get the muscles going before I actually switch the weight up and do something a bit heavier. For me. It wasn't so much about going super heavy or anything. It was more about increasing the reps and just trying to max out um, the number of reps I can do. Really, you know, really exhaust the muscle a bit. As you'll see later on, it, it really takes it out of me. So you don't have to go too heavy all the time. So the key thing to remember is when you pull the weight back it's 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 really good to at least hold it for even if um a split second at least and control the weight down. Sometimes you know when it's pretty heavy and I'm trying to squeeze out the last few, I might just break form a bit. But um that's that's not best case. Um generally you should lower the weight and control it down. But yeah, just hold this at the end, squeeze the muscles, you know, make sure you feel in the muscles in the back, uh, tighten up as you, as you pull back the weight, uh, hold it for a second and then bring it down gradually. And hopefully you should get the pump, like I think I'm getting there. <laughs> well, you be the judge of that. <laughs> This lat pull down exercise here is really good. Uh, the key thing I think about this is um, to stick your chest out, almost like you're pushing your chest up. It's, it's just like a reverse pull up when you look at it. So stick your chest out and you're trying to bring your arms, your elbows down to your sides. Because the, the problem some people have with this is they you know, when the weight gets a bit heavier, they tend to like cave the chest in to help pull with their abs and everything else other than the, the lats as they should do. So try as best you can to push your chest out and uh, pull down. Um, even if the even if you find the weight is feeling a bit heavier, either you do less reps or you try to squeeze out something and you drop the weight and you go again. Yeah, one tip to actually ensure you hit the lats properly is to keep your chin up. That way you're forced to stick your chest out. So just keep the chin up and that should help. So then I moved on to actually doing some biceps, uh, bicep training. I uh, didn't spend too much time on it because, you know, life called. Um, 
But uh, here I started with uh, 60 kg. Just repped it out. I thought I'd, I'd go from the heavies and then work my way down because you need to remember that all the the work I've been doing before with the back. All these exercises have been hitting the biceps as a secondary muscle. So what I did for each time I did the reps, um, I'd remove 10 kg, you know, and just to just to make sure I, I force the muscle to do as much work as I can. And I'd go to failure all the time. So even if I struggled to squeeze one out, then I just had to force it out, yeah. Um, in particular, you might see me in the first set just, you know, getting off the seat a bit. It's not ideal. Um, but for me, because the muscle had already been pre-exhausted from doing the, the back workout, I just thought I'd just go and just you know, force it as much as I can from my biceps. It was a pretty good workout anyway. Um, yeah, so that's that, that was pretty good. Just to keep going, decreasing by 10 kg every time until I went all the way down to the um, the 20 kg plate and then I, I think I repped out like 10. But yeah, so keep looking, subscribe, give me your feedback and um, see you guys soon again.